because that's all it does. Okay. Alright guys, welcome to another 31 Days of Horror Ween. Today we are playing Summer of 58. I've heard it's more of a... What's it called? A... Walking experience more than an actual game, but I know it's scary and creepy, and so I'm, that's good enough for me for this 31 Days of Horror Ween. So without any further ado, we play Summer of 58. <laughs> Sometimes people make up things that aren't there. It seems to them that some entity controls their mind and their life. They do terrible things that can drive you crazy. I don't believe in paranormal phenomena. I believe that the troubles that people commit are their own fault or those who brought them to this. And in order for you to believe your eyes and not fictions, I made revealing videos about paranormal phenomena in two houses in which, according to people's stories, madness was happening. My name is Alex Morton, and we're getting started. Let's get started, Alex Morton. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm not playing yet, by the way. <laughs> I'm along for the ride currently. This gives me a Resident Evil feeling though, you know? Ooh. Blood, it's always a fun thing to see. Okay, creepy mask. Creepy stairs. Music is intensifying for some reason. I searched all the corners, but I didn't find any evidence confirming paranormal activity in these houses. Now I'm going to an abandoned pioneer camp in Russia at the request of my subscribers to find out if the rumors that the locals have been talking about for so many years are true. They say that there are ghosts of dead people in this place at the hands of one of the residents he himself has never been found. The bodies of those people were also not found. Local residents avoid this place and those who were touched by this tragedy do not allow to open the doors of this building in memory of the dead and missing. I came to Russia to investigate what happened to find out if the rumors are true and to find evidence of this. In keeping with my tradition, I close the doors of the building behind me so that there is no temptation to leave it. And I'm staying here for a few nights recording a report. I have a video camera, a sleeping bag, a backpack with things, and food with me. Cue with a creepy door opening. Okay. Looting. Okay. Emeka Games presents a game where I walk. Okay, whoa, Russian English dictionary. Yeah, we'll take that. We're probably gonna need it. Uh okay. Yeah. Interesting, the middle mouse button is how you zoom in. There's a creepy art. A creepy art. Yeah. Hello, little doll. I guess it's gonna stay a little dark. That's fine. Fine with me. Hey. Okay. I I mean maybe that's fine. They can feed the cats there if they want to. A train I hear? It sounds like a train. Okay, gas masks in there. It's kinda creepy. Oh, okay. I was like, I think I hear a cat. 
I do. There's two cats there. Okay. In 1958, towards the end of the summer, parents called the camp to find out if everything was all right with their children, but no one answered. When they arrived at the camp, they found no one. Only abandoned things and a mess. All the locals helped in the search for the missing children, but all in vain. Yeah. That. Not a cigarette, but it's okay. Well, I guess. Okay. All right. Just kick him in. Okay, thank you. Good job. I was like, just... Someone trying to get through the door? That's what it sounded like, wasn't it? All right. Let's get back to knocking these boards in. Thank you. I don't like that bunny. That is a suspicious looking bunny. Okay. Dead bird. I don't know if I like the noises I'm hearing here. There are legends that there was an orphanage near this camp, and there lived a strange girl who was afraid of water. She did not wash and did not go to the river. One day, the older girls decided to laugh at her, tied her hands, and poured water over her. She was very scared and ran away. They couldn't find her for many days, and they decided that she was dead. But one night, she came back in her pajamas, all wet, and killed everyone who bullied her. After that, her spirit appears in the bathroom on a full moon. Ugh. I'll take the lighter, thank you. Wait, what? There was a bird in there! Birdie! Night, night, alright. Night, whatever. Whatever, I guess. Bird, just go be free. It's fine with me, whatever. I don't know. The summer of 58. Hi, kitty. Oh. Okay. Let's go back to the other room. That's right. What was that? I am not liking that bunny. Okay, so there's candles in there. So what? I do not, I do not like that bunny. I want to go see in that other room if the bunny is still over here now. Because I don't like that. Mr. Bunny, you're supposed to be over there. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about that because I can't do anything about it. Front door, perhaps? Let's get out of here. Oh. If I can find a spare one. All right, well, let's find a spare one. An investigation is currently underway at the disappearance of children employees of the Eunice Pioneer Camp, which opened in 1955 under the leadership of Director Maria. Anatoly Levna. Hey, the suspect in this case is a child living in this camp. The name is Yakov. 
Evidence of the victims was found in his locker. What happened to him where he is now is not known. I don't like that knowledge. When you read a paper, you want to read, yes, they were caught. They are no longer at large. You don't want to hear, oh yeah, we don't know where he is. No. Like, can I flip that thing? I want to flip it. I guess I don't get a look at that thing. That's all right, whatever. I don't like you. I don't like the bunny more, that's for sure, but you know. There has to be a fuse somewhere. This does give me kind of a PT vibe, you know? Okay, a starfish. Okay. Ugh. I'm not a fan of all this artwork. You know what I mean? Okay, good. That did me a lot of good. Nineteen forty six. Hello, children. Okay. I don't know. Supposed to find a fuse? Okay. No idea what that is, but all right, cool. Already read you. Me. Oh. My sleeping bag. Crouch. Okay, thank you. That's all I wanted was to be able to crouch. Jeez. I feel like there's some things that I can't even, like, get. Yeah. All right, I'm not quite sure. I'm not quite sure where it stopped recording, but we're going to continue from here. All right, in case it missed it, I just found candles. I just lit them, and there's a creepy bunny. Creepy stuffed bunny lurking around. Don't like it. But now I can spread out my sleeping bag, it said. So da, 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 da. Done. Need to prepare for the night. I don't know. Oh, okay. Loading. Night number one. Okay, this is actually kind of creepy looking. Uh, yeah, I want to... 
Take my lighter with me. Okay. Dead birds everywhere. Not a good thing. Okay. I also don't know if I like that this door is shut, but I swear this bunny is still over here. Okay, he's now right there. He was behind that glass. Can't keep up with this guy, dude. I can't, I can't, I can't, I don't want to. Okay. Alright, we're chilling, we're chilling, we're doing okay. The fuse is missing. Well, of course it's missing. Hey, okay, all the pots are knocked over. I can't read what it says. I need to get my Russian English dictionary. What? I thought I already had it. Whatever. Whatever. I thought I already had it, but all right. You do you, friend. Ugh. The handsome woman. Creepy. You're right. It is. Where's my Russian English dictionary? Why did that fall out of my pocket? I have to like pick that up every time or I don't know. Oh my gosh. This just got horrifying. I don't care for those footsteps. It's freaking bunny. Oh, I don't care for all these noises. This is... Okay. No. No, thank you. The bunny's gone again. Freaking bunny! I'm not liking this. I think it sounds like it's snacking on something. Whoa, what the? I don't like that those doors are open. I'm out. Okay, ma'am. Do you want to get the door or do you want me? I'll get the fun. Oh. Did I just get hit on the back of the head or something with like a frying pan? That's what it sounded like. Bonk. It seems like I did. Oh. 
Okay, then. This is... Interesting. Gosh dang it! My rush- ah. Why do they do this to me? Wait, is there already someone here? During the day! That's not what you... Who's breathing? I'm not scared. Where are you? You freaking breather. I'm not scared. I'm a little scared. <laughs> I'm a I'm a little frightened, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. It's just a little horrifying. Right, now I can read this thing. Late at night, when people fall asleep, no need for fun and no need for a fool. And the bells are empty and the eyes are full of bitterness. The courtiers do not know what the fun means to the fool. The fool decides that enough is enough. And he that night, wearing a sad suit, poisons the court and the king. I'm sad at heart, but the plan is not a failure. The fool will no longer be fun. Hey! Hi, buddy! Hi! Aw, oh, cute little... I think it's a dove, or a pigeon. I want to say a dove. Cute. Okay. Well, so things can't be bad, right? There's a dove right there. We're, we're good. Yeah, we're all right. Let's get rid of these boards now. Let's go into this room, which probably is not a good idea because there's a whole bunch of blood on the ground. I, I gotta do what I gotta do. Act. Here we go. All right. Hello, Mr. Fox. You look rather mischievous. More dead birds. Okay. More random pieces of, like, playground equipment. I need to find the fuse for a lot of things. That's the problem. I don't know if I'm going to find a fuse this whole time, you know? I just, I don't know. Hey! A fuse! And I'll use the light bulbs for lighting. I agree. I got a fuse. The fuse is missing. I thought I got the fuse. Alright, well. Okay. Light bulb? No, still? Okay, whatever. I thought I got a fuse, so imagine my disappointment when it's like, nah, it's not good enough. 
I thought I found the fuse in there. Wasn't that not the fuse in that box? Alright, whatever. I'm over it. Where's that bunny at? Oh. Mine's in Fort 58. Huh? Okay. Your creepy toy as well that I just barely saw for the first time. Ew. I feel like ew is an extreme word to use sometimes for describing something that should be cute. But I'm sorry, sometimes it's just, that's an ew. Like, that's just, nope. That's a nope, nope. That's a nope, nope. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Somehow I'm going over here. Probably not smart, but I am. What is this? Okay. Hmm? Sounded new, I didn't like that. Hmm. Not that I can do anything over here. But you know, whatever. Let's head back over, I guess? Because I can't do anything over there. <laughs> I swear I got the fuse. I'm upset. Oh, well. Just trying to figure out what's going on here, guys. Don't mind me. Opening of the youth children's camp. 1955. Okay. That's cool. Go back, I guess, and see if, uh... Oh, I don't like the handprints. I didn't notice that before. Nope, I sure did not. Yeah, I don't like that. Watch. Oh, I gotta take the box with me. Okay. That shouldn't have been so freaky because I should have expected it, but still, it definitely put me on nerve. On edge there a little bit. It cleared out my nose. That's for sure. Aha, uh -huh. turn on the light. I mean, I don't think I can currently. It's not gonna let me. Okay, do I have to, is that one switch I have to go to? Is that what I have to do? Probably not a good idea. 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 Hey, we did it.
Yeah, let's turn that off, please. Oh no! Where'd my little guy go? Little guy. Where are you, little guy? I'm gonna name him Dave the Dove. Where did Dave go? Dave! Dave the Dove! Where did you go? I don't want to go back over here. But I will. Uh, no! Why would you? No, 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 no! You're good! I need to go to bed soon. What's wrong with you? Alright, well. Sure, let's go to bed. Why not? Let's just get this over with, huh? I don't agree with it. I don't think it's a good idea, but let's do it. Night dos. Summer of 58. Buck stopped at 3.07 a.m. Big shocker. I don't even know why it's just, why, why does it just, like, assume, I'm just going to take you. Like, let's just skip the formality here. I am just going to take you. Alright, let's go investigate. This is where the little girl went in, was in this room. Okay. I don't like that. I don't like that. I'll be over here until you decide what you're doing. Until you stop that. <laughs> oh gosh, why? Where did Dave go? I'm upset like Dave has just disappeared, you know? Where am I Dave? I'm not a fan. It looked literally like they were being pulled. <laughs> Still got me though. Okay, I see the silhouette of somebody. I'm good. Wait, what just happened? Yeah, there's a lot of things that weren't here before, buddy. I don't think I want to know what's inside. I'm good. Believe it or not, like, I'm good. Why do I hear breathing? I don't like hearing breathing. Let's shut that door. No! I don't like this. Nope. This is not what we call a good thing. Why do I hear dripping? Why do I hear dripping? I don't know why I hear dripping, and I don't like dripping. Nope. Gonna be in this room, isn't it? Sure is. What's with these bunny looking creatures?
I don't like that because there's gonna be a jump scare now. Oh. I'm not focused on the box, I'm focused on this thing. Ugh. Like, that thing is freaking horrifying looking. I don't appreciate it. That's why you ease into it and don't just go, hmm? Gosh. Okay, and of course it's gone. That's just what I want. That's just, yeah, it's wonderful news. No! Why are they making the most horrifying looking creature in this game the actual real entity? No. You know what? Screw you. Ah! Called his bluff. Called his bluff. Still made me jump. It still made me jump. Ah! I didn't care for it. I didn't. One's heart can only take so much. You know what I mean? It only takes so much. Why am I chasing... Well, let's shut this door too then. Because if that's what we're about... Yeah, let's go see what the breathing is. Is it me breathing? Maybe it's me breathing. Even though it sounds like it's coming from behind me. I'm sorry. Let's go see what's going on in here. I'm sorry. Okay. Didn't expect nudity. We'll edit this out, but let's see what we can do. Hmm? Ball. Ball. Hmm? Ball? With this key, I can open the box. I don't know if I want to freaking open the box. I think I'm good. Holy cow, which box am I going for? It's probably not a good idea to open boxes. Dear Diary, today is the annual opening day of my camp. I have been preparing for this for three years so that this summer will be special for me. During these days, I will bring up real people in them, but they will also help me a lot. Okay. What do you mean? Oh. After severe thunderstorm, there is no light in the building. Okay, so this is like what happened back then? Oh, don't you dare. Wait, I have to... Okay. So this is what happened back in the day now. Okay, this is cool. I like this. This is cool. Someone found and hid my key to my safe. Make the wrong diagnosis for Ivan. He needs a heart just plant. Only this will help him. I no longer have the strength to fight with the doctors. Not to come I will heal my son myself no matter what it takes. Okay, good luck with that. You only do so much. The birds, jeez. Yeah, 
Let's go figure out what's going on here. Back in the day when this place was new. Huh. A scale? Why is there a scale tucked in that corner? Weird. The heck? Anna, we need to run. It's all because of the director. I was spying on her. She was talking to someone about something bad. You have to believe me. Warn everyone. We don't have much time until I... I hid her key in the closet. We can make it. Help me. What? What? Uh. What? They broke my window. Oh, a bird flew through. What the heck? Okay. Okay. The key to the safe. Oh, it was just in the... Okay. I can't. Alright, whatever. Alright, well, let's go open my safe here. You filthy child. Okay. What do we got in here? Yako Paris stole the second gas. We worked together in an orphanage, and I acted carelessly, and I received a complaint. The doctor had to close the shelter. I was spent for medical work, and I will not make such a mistake, because only he knows about our agreement. I must continue to find people for him to collect their kidneys. And Alexei Sergeyevich will help to perform a heart transplant operation for Ivan. According to all indicators from the medical record, Yark Yakov is an idle donor. I'll set up an accident and no one will look for him. Okay, so this is all covered just to save your son? I need to spray sleeping gas so that all the children can be transferred to the hospital for surgery and then return back. Okay. A special boy, Yakov, came to the camp. He has no parents or relatives and he became my favorite because he is so similar to my son Ivan. I really wanted to see him. Yakov is a good boy, although he does not speak, but he understands everything and does everything I ask. In the afternoon, I had to meet with Alexei Serkevich. At the shelter where we used to work, he ordered us to fulfill our agreement tonight. This day has come. Yakov will help me with this before going to bed. Children always invent horror stories. Well, the counts put them. This can distract them. Hey. Oh, that's creepy. I like that I ran away. Okay, so I'm freaking poisoning the kids. Okay. Ivan, I'll save you soon. I'll say that one just got opened. Okay. Interesting. Get out of here. Leave this place alone.
That just happened. I don't know if this is a good idea. Sure, let's go get the phone. Obviously a bigger priority. Bunny's back. Ugh. Freaking bunny. Yeah, ride it again. Why not? Probably not going to go the same way twice here. Okay. Okay. I was accused, but I didn't do it. Get out of here. You can get right out of here, dude. Yep, we're gonna write another message here. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Yes, here I can communicate with my friends. We guard this place because it is our home. A lot of people came here to just to break our things, but my friends helped me to arrive away strangers. I'm afraid that someone will see me and tell me that I live here and those people will come for me. Well? You! With this bunny! It just keeps appearing like For your friends, why are they here too? I don't trust this. It's like it's setting something up, you know? Spread to this place, those who were tortured here, they remained locked up here. That day in the evening after the lights out, someone came, probably it was the person who whom the director spoke. He didn't find me. I think that's because of this. He poisoned all the residents and the director. No, I want to go see the other window! All this was planned by the director of the camp? What are you talking about? What kind of person was he talking to?
Horrifying to see. Little miscreant. Like, something's gonna happen. There's no way we're just gonna have a two-way communication between me and this person. Without something happening. Like, it's setting something up. I just, I feel it. I feel it in my bones. It's all her. I saw our director. Oh my gosh, roll her fast. I saw our director talking to someone in an old hospital near the camp. They agreed that they would do their work at night. Then I realized that it was connected with us, but I couldn't warn everyone. I didn't see who else was there. Because I was scared and hid. In the morning, I went into the village and found no one. Her safe was also not there. I thought that the man and assistants had taken everyone away and hidden the bodies in that building. I had to stay here and live in the ventilation. Only sometimes go to the rooms. Dang. Tense. Lived in the ventilation? Uncomfortable. Very itty bitty living space. That building abandoned? Can I get there? Can I, can I, can I, can I? Take me to the building. Yoink. To the boards off the, uh, to the abandoned hospital. Okay. Seems safe. Seems like a good idea. Let's go do it. Yeah. I wonder if there's multiple endings to this. Time to tear the boards off the front, huh? Why did I put boards on this anyway when I got here? That doesn't make sense. I was going for the big exclusive experience of being stuck in here, apparently. I don't like that I still hear the music box so song going on. Night number three. Like, am I still in this cabin, or am I in the abandoned hospital now? Oh, gosh. Fun! Okay, a whole new place to go. The abandoned hospital. This is a great idea. Really good idea. Okay. This is gonna go well. Because I can't go anywhere. I hear noises over there. I don't know what proof I'm looking for. I can't go anywhere. What was that? Did I experience something? Because I didn't see anything.
Oh no, I literally didn't see anything. Hello? Oh, what the what? After the war, dozens of children end up in shelters after losing their parents. An orphanage for the maintenance and upbringing of our orphans worked in the leadership of the military. Well, that's good news. I don't know. Okay. I have... I don't know. So many noises in this game, holy cow. Shut that. No, no, thanks, dude. No, thank you. I'll find my own way. Gosh. Ah! Hey, little one. That's horrifying. Dr. Orbiter was detained for illegal organ trafficking for six years. He fraudulently made incorrect diagnosis before him to remove the kidney. The director did not know about this, but he could not continue to be in position of the Which is where we're at right now. Good. Give me my backpack. An angle grinder? Oh, my heart! Stop it. Okay. I have to fish right. So I know that's fine. We're getting the angle grinder here. Oh. Did someone just grab it from him? Yeah, here we go. We're coming through, guys. Thank you. That's right. I go where I want to go. You can't stop me from going where I want to go. I go where I want. I do what I want. I'm an adult. I don't need your ghostly validation to show me where I want to go. I know what I'm doing is wrong, but I have no choice. I have to say my son, Ivan. I was lucky with Alexei Sergeyevich. Agreed to help. I must let him down. No one should know about our affairs. Well, too bad. I know about your affairs. Sure do. I know what you what you was doing was wrong. And yeah, so take that. I know things. Sure, let's go in this door that seems sketchy and creepy. Why wouldn't this be where I wanted to go, you know? Here I come. Ready or not. Oh, let's go forward. Went that way somewhere, so. Whoa. Surgical room, it looks like. Yeah, we're all about surgical rooms, ain't we? Yeah, sure. Yeah.
I don't know what I mean. I didn't have time to save him. I don't believe it. This can't be happening. This is not my Venechka. I'll save him. I need to find a donor urgently. Okay. What's with this running water? Okay, bolt cutters? I don't need bolt cutters. I got my angle grinder. Oh. Okay. Gosh. I know there's a scare coming. Yeah. Okay, we're going this way, apparently. Fate has chosen for me where I'm going. Uh-huh. Go for it. The heck was that? Serenade of ghostly spirits? I don't know if I'll make it to the morning because today's shift is bothering me. I want to run away from here, but then I won't get paid. What is happening behind me? I hear voices as if I'm not alone. I thought I saw a woman more like her silhouette or shadow. She went to the closet. I'm afraid to follow her maybe the closet. I don't want to check if it's true or maybe just my imagination, which has sharpened after a glass of vodka. On the cabinet waste some products made of feathers and cobwebs. I've never seen them anywhere. They look terrible, and it smells of dead things from there. Okay, I'll have another glass and go to bed until morning. Okay. Not a good idea. Gosh, what's with all these creepy dolls and toys and shiz? No, thank you. Okay. Alright, well, I think I'm going to the next room now. Hmm. <sighs> regaining composure. Regaining composure. We're good. We're good. Okay. Yeah! That was pleasant. That was nice. Thanks for sharing that. Ah. <sighs> just, it's fine. My heart is just gone. That's fair. Okay. Why? No! 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 Not fair. Okay. What's your wise plan now, Randy? Oh, okay, or just wait for the door to open itself. That's, that's good. This is good news. Mm. This game should just be called Jump Scare Game, because that's all it does. Okay. Okay. That was different. I didn't expect that. That thing's the real creepy thing. Gonna say that now. A year later, after the events in fifty, the building was reclassified as a hospital, but with budget cuts, it stopped working again. Of course it did. Why would it be reopened? Gosh. Of course it'd be a secret compartment. Of course it would be, yeah. This is not a good idea. Nope. Oh my. Yeah. Yup, and this is why you leave closets closed. Especially ones hidden in an abandoned hospital behind a cabinet case. Jeez. Okay.
Okay, that's not good. Let the one who finds me feel the pain of a mother who has lost her child. I curse everyone who couldn't help me, and I'm not going. I'm not just going to leave. I'll be back. If I may. Death certificate. Mine. Here are the documents from 1958. Alexei Sergeyevich, about whom Maria spoke, replied to her that he would no longer participate in this and refused to work with her. Then, what was the case in question, and who was she talking to when Yakov saw her? There's something else. The death certificate document, this is her son, Ivan. He died in the fall of 19 Apparently, she couldn't stand him when crazy. She wanted to save him so badly that she lost touch with reality. A woman. Okay, so is she just going to randomly appear now in here? Probably. Okay. Need to get out of here as soon as possible. Yeah. That's nice. This is... This was helpful. I'm, I am glad I stopped by. Thanks for having me. My heart can't take much more of this. <laughs> No, it can't. No, it can't. And I think we're at the end now, so all it's gonna be is freaking f jump scare, jump scare, jump scare. That's all it's going to be now. Let's go. What's gonna happen? Something's gonna happen. Oh. Three weeks later. I'm- I came back? Why, 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 why would I come back? Hello, Yakov. You no longer need to be afraid that you will be found and accused of something that you didn't do. I think of everything. I didn't tell anyone that you live here with your friends. Protect this place further. Now it is rightfully only your home. Your friend, Alex Morton. Oh, I'm so nice. You're welcome. I'm sorry. I would let saving dogs lie. I wouldn't come back. I'm glad this investigation turned out to be so interesting and unique. I managed to solve the mystery of at the end. Help Yakov find peace and freedom. You can read about this in my blog. We need to move on. I'm going to another place with a terrible history where witches used to live. And there I will have an unusual case. I will tell you about it later. Interesting. So is that going to be like a sequel to this game? Hmm. Uh, 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 uh. In the summer of 58. Is that it? Is there like... Doesn't take you to the screen. I don't know. Maybe we'll see now. I guess. Isn't that like the Blair Witch symbol right there? Oh. Hold on. Apparently there's more. What is this part now? I had to wait for the person who bought this house, but after his arrival a few days later, something went wrong. This place is just to be harmless. I am trapped here. I don't think that a woman from a shelter in Russia could get attached and follow me. Does this house have a pendulum for people like her? What if other spirits followed me? Maybe that's why I didn't find anyone in those houses. I miraculously managed to escape from that abandoned orphanage. But I am not sure that I will be released now. We need to try out and warn that guy that's dangerous to stay here. Okay, so this is apparently a continuation? Alrighty then. Yeah, it's not healthy.
I mean, I hear whispering. I don't like it. I don't like that. This is like a Blair Witch thing now. Ma'am? Are we going for more jump scares now? What is happening? Please don't do this to me. <laughs> Open says me? Sounds like someone's slapping the door with like a fish. Ma'am? Okay. Huh. Bravo. That definitely was an interesting game. I enjoyed that. I actually did enjoy it. Uh, definitely had some good jump scares versus some cheap jump scares, but definitely had a way of pulling you into the story and kind of just really giving a good creepy vibe to it. I enjoyed that. I actually really did. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. Hopefully you enjoyed the video as well. And if you haven't, please watch my other many different... 31 Days of Horror Ween videos. There's so many different scary games that you may have heard of, may not have heard of, but I play them throughout the month of October. So make sure you guys check those out. And if you're interested in watching me playing more of those certain games, please leave a comment in the comments below on that video. Don't forget also to follow and subscribe to my many channels that are listed right here for you guys so you don't miss out on the latest and greatest from yours truly. Thanks for watching and remember to see you guys all next time. Stay spooky.